Evolution is needed in every business. The composite tipping vessel is not only evolution, it is a totally new concept. From conception to building the factory, including the tooling, everything was new and developed by Spitzer Eurovrack. Because this was a new concept, it was necessary to take a step-by-step -step approach in developing the prototype barrel. We worked closely with our certificating body using well understood and accepted methods within the composite industry. Using dynamic methods to analyze the vessel performance, the prototype trailer was tested in all types of load situations over many months. Before the composite vessel could go into production, it was necessary to conceive and build tools to achieve the high quality results needed time after time. It was decided that to give the vessel as much strength as possible, it should be built in a continuous process. Due to the shape and load needs of the ends of the barrel, they are made by another process. The carbon fiber fabric is laid over a male form and a female form is then clamped over the top before resin is pumped in under pressure. The front and rear sections are then bonded to the barrel using a ferrule and socket method. Then they are reinforced inside and out by using impregnated carbon fiber cloth to bridge the sections binding them together in a seamless joint. The bonding of the other supports and fixing points is accomplished by using a very elastic material which ensures a progressive strong joint. The composite material has different characteristics to that of aluminium. It does not work harden or fatigue like aluminium. The thickness and makeup of the vessel wall gives it great strength and increased stability. The resin or matrix is the medium that holds the fibers together. Cracks may be seen in the resin and is often caused by a concentration of resin. Tests carried out over many thousands of cycles have proven that these imperfections do not evolve into defects. Tests have also proven that during normal use it's highly unlikely that a catastrophic failure could occur and it would be preceded by a numerous indicators of a structural instability. The composite barrel cannot tear like an aluminium one. The composite material gives a high resistance to shock without plastic distortion. It does not dent like alloy barrels. If the barrel is punctured, it can be repaired. It is a simple method and can be undertaken by that used to working with fiberglass, such as boat repairs. Obviously, any repair would need to be carried out using the materials and methods agreed with Spitzer Eurovrack. Spitzer Eurovrack has conceived and produced the first composite tank for the powder tank industry. It has the weight benefit of a vessel of a similar size and dimensions of approximately 30%, giving higher payloads than a similar alloy barrel. The risk of damage to the vessel from vacuum induced by changes in temperature or gravity discharge is reduced. The inside of the vessel is very smooth, which is an important factor for the food industry and also make the composite tank one of the best to discharge. The standard vessel interior finish allows the transport of a wide variety of products from alkaline to acidic. It is also possible to line the vessel to cope with other products if needed. The complex nature of the vessel wall achieves a much lower rate of thermal conductivity than a standard alloy vessel, reducing condensation, helping reduce mildew in food products. Finally, the construction of the vessel and its internal finish make the vessel much easier to clean, reducing the need for washing out.
The composite tanker was recognized by the industry for its innovation by winning the first prize for technical innovation at the transport exhibition in Lyon, France.